Hey folks and um, welcome to today's video and um, what I decided to talk about today was um, bringing reading as a part of your daily routine um, as I think like and especially over the long term it will do you the world of good. Um, now in terms of reading it's always been something I've I've wanted to do and um, you know and and I've long had a goal to like you know, to eventually at the point where I'm reading a book a week, like, and that's still the goal, that's still the goal, and in the past I have procrastinated on it, you know, it, 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 and I'm sure you can relate with, with this, it's like, there's things you know would help you out, but it's just, you know, it's like we just like procrastinate and just don't do it, but over, I don't know, the last couple of weeks maybe, I'm not exactly sure, I, I have like, like, you know, been strict with it to do it every day, and um and uh, what i've decided to do is like um is like just like just start small just you know because you know it's like you know, when i first started reading it's like i've done three pages and it's like i'm feeling kind of like i want to put the book down it's, uh, and it's like do much more it's like you try to push but it's like it's it, it, it's actually hard it's kind of like weights in the gym it's like you reach like your comfortable amount but then you know you get to a point where it's like oh my like like you could do more but it, it's a struggle and how I've decided to do is like you know like like find about where I'm at and then do a little bit more than that and then like kind of leave it um and then and then the next time you know like see how that feels and then you know if that's not like that's fine do a little bit more and and over time just gradually build it up and also an important thing to do is to build the habit of actually reading because because if you get the habit down that you know you're doing it every day you know like even if you do even if you're doing like say five pages a day like like doing that consistently beats like doing 20 pages and then you know for a month and then stopping you know um yeah like so so yes yeah, so that's kind of two things to consider like like you want to be consistent and 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 then and then from that consistency like the more you do on on a daily basis the better you know and perhaps like a third thing like you know, like, you know, make sure, like, you're implementing what you're actually reading, because, like, you know, and, you know, take a, I've made, like, you know, self-help videos and things, it's like, we just watch the self-help video, you know, you know, you know, you know, to kind of watch the self-help video without actually, like, you know, like, implementing it, you know, it's probably better watching, like, one, one video actually taking action on all that's been said, you know, what's relevant to you, than reading, like, then watching like free and then just doing nothing. So, so there's some things to consider. Um, a book I'm reading right now is The Power of Now, and you know, and that's how far I've gone through it. So what's that? I don't know. What is it about? Half maybe, but half. Um, and the and the kind of like what I'm doing on a daily basis is about five to ten pages, which I know isn't much, but you know, I feel like but i've been consistent with the habit and um yeah and it's like like i said like gradually increasing it and hopefully i get to a point where reading a book a week like that's the goal um so yeah i um invite you to get on reading and and also like that i didn't mention is like and this is for me it's like you know some people say the reading fiction books like you can get lessons from uh that as well and you know if you can get like things that can help you in your life then then that's then that's great um but you know like like no you 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 kind of like gold you gotta think about like you know you know like you know like in terms of your reading do you want to be reading something that just for entertainment and you don't you know like you know maybe a cool story but you know you might not get um like real like things you can like take from the book and improve your life with you know like yeah so I'm just like suggesting to read books that that's that's like filled with like useful information that you can actually use and you'll find that commonly in self-help books and and and, in, and some fiction books and maybe in there as well like yeah but just just be aware of it like you know like because for me it's like if I'm reading like especially not being like like you know a natural reader you know it, you know it's like you know like you know it takes some building for me it's like like the books I am reading like when I do read I, 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 like I want it to be like 
like a one in return on investment with her. Um, yes, there's some things, there's some uh, things to uh, think about in terms of your reading. Definitely get on that, and um, and and this book, The Power of Now, is amazing. So like, definitely get on that, and um, yeah, yeah, it's really like open my eyes up more to uh, be present the moment, and um, and yeah, um, it's really good. So yeah, hopefully this video has um, has um, had some useful uh, advice i guess well his advice but it's like i feel like i'm just like on the journey as well so i'm just like kind of sharing what i've experienced with it um yeah um if you have any insights leave a comment below i'd love to hear it and um and yeah uh hopefully there was some value and um um thanks for watching i will see you next time